Oh, look, if I get this done quick enough, we might have time to stop for churros. And look, that's not a racist thing, Pablo. That's just a great dessert. Okay. You know I'm not Mexican, right? That's the spirit. Sit tight, watch the wheels. Back in a jiff. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're doing delicious churros. Bring back those memories of when you were a child at Disneyland. Very simple to make. We're going to start off with our large saucepan. Get it under medium heat. We're going to add one cup of water, six tablespoons of butter, a quarter tablespoon of sugar, and a teaspoon of vanilla. Get that all in the pan and get that brought up to heat where it starts to melt and bubble a little bit. And once we get that up, we're going to have one cup of flour, turn the heat off, and we're going to mix that up until we get a nice little ball of dough. While I'm doing that, if I can remind you to please like, share, subscribe, tell your friends about the channel, leave a comment if you can, I appreciate it. All right, now once we have this into a little ball of dough, we're going to toss it into our mixing bowl of our stand mixer and let that cool for a few minutes. While that's cooling, we're going to make the cinnamon sugar dip to put the churros in once we fry them up. Half a cup of sugar, about a tablespoon of cinnamon, and just mix that up real good. And we'll set that to the side until our churros are fried up. Now we've got our paddle on our mixer. Got that dough mixing up and we're going to add three eggs. And we're going to mix that up until you see the consistency here. That's what you're looking for right there. Now we're going to remove this and put it into a piping bag or I bought this little churro maker off Amazon. It was like $8. Worked great. Just kind of push the dough through. Goes right in the hot oil. That oil is at 350 degrees, by the way. And just use a knife to cut it. And... You gotta make sure it's golden brown on both sides. It takes about four or five minutes to make. Take those churros out, put on a rack with some paper towel to drain a little bit of that oil off. But while they're still warm, you wanna toss them into the sugar and cinnamon so that sugar cinnamon sticks to the churro. Now the only thing you need to make is the chocolate sauce. It's an option. But it's a great option. What we're going to need for that is equal amount semi-sweet chocolate chips and cream. Mix it up. Pop it in the microwave for about a minute and a half. And once it comes out of the microwave, you're going to give it a good mix. And you are ready to serve your churros to the kids, yourself, everybody delicious dessert make these your kids will love you all right thanks for watching come back again